Caitlin Clark pulled off the shot of the year, leaving Tyrese Halliburton in awe. Back Benley, handoff Clark, launches, and hits a three! Caitlin Clark is a human highlight machine. She lulls you to sleep with her playmaking before bringing out the deep threes and flashy drives to the basket. The opposing defenses quickly get overwhelmed and have no clue what to do with her. They sometimes resort to simply fouling her. <coughs> uh, Chicago Sky. Caitlin puts every team in a dilemma. Should they play her tight and take away her three? If they did that, then Caitlin simply found a teammate cutting to the basket or had someone set her a screen so she could attack the rim. And if they didn't press up on her, she has her patented three ball, which has slowly begun to translate to the WNBA. Caitlin is unguardable. And by the end of this video, you will see why Tyrese Halliburton couldn't believe what he saw. The game between the Indiana Fever and the Atlanta Dream was incredibly exciting, not only because Caitlin set another historical record, but the collective team effort showed that the Fever are a threat in the playoffs. Caitlin has continued to improve throughout her historic rookie season. Entering Sunday's game against the Atlanta Dream, she was averaging 24.6 points, 9 rebounds, and 5.6 assists on shooting splits of 47% from the floor, 40% from three-point range, and 93% from the line since the WNBA schedule resumed. So no wonder people think she needs to be in the MVP conversation. She is on pace to become the first player in league history to average at least 18 points, 8 assists, and 5 rebounds. Now what made the Fever performance really special was the way the entire team played. Aaliyah Boston scored a career-high 30 points and grabbed 13 rebounds, and Caitlin Clark added 26 points and 12 assists to help the Indiana Fever beat Atlanta 104-100 to in overtime. Now the game really came down to the wire. Boston was called for an illegal screen with 2 minutes 8 seconds left in overtime, and Howard hit a short contested fadeaway jumper to give Atlanta 98-96 lead 15 seconds later. Mitchell missed a reverse layup on the other end, but Boston was there for the offensive rebound and put back with 1 minute 39 seconds remaining, and then scored in the post with just over a minute to play to give Indiana a 198 lead. Clark made 4 of 4 from the free throw line from there to seal it. Boston made 11 of 16 from the field and 8 of 8 from the free throw line while Clark posted her franchise record 14th double-double of the season for Indiana. Kelsey Mitchell added 21 points and Lexi Hole scored 12 on 4 of 5 shooting from 3-point range. Now, One of the most exciting plays of the game was when Kalen hit an unbelievable 3-point shot that left Tyrese Halliburton in awe. Indiana Pacers superstar was sitting courtside at the game and he had a perfect seat to see Clark hit one of the coolest three-pointers of her young WNBA career. The pictures that came afterward were even better. Tyrese couldn't believe what he had just seen. Now, of course, this isn't the first time that Kalen has wowed Hallie. Earlier in the year, he came to a game where the Indiana Fever were taking on the Phoenix Mercury. In the first half against the Mercury, Caitlin tallied 16 points on 55.6% shooting, which included three triples with five assists and four rebounds. Just complete and utter dominance. She also made some WNBA history in the process. Caitlin became the first player in WNBA history to score at least 450 points and tally at least 200 assists in a rookie season. Only five other players in league history have achieved that feat in any other year of their careers. Caitlin finished the game with 29 points, 5 rebounds, and 10 assists on 50% shooting from the field. But more than the stats, it is how she dominated the game that is really impressive. She dissected the Mercury defense thanks to her incredible vision, which resulted in easy buckets for her teammates play after play. She even had a beautiful full-court dime that had NBA star Tyrese Halliburton in awe. Now that is a scary sight for the rest of the league. A few people have criticized her shooting efficiency and have held that against her. However, Kaylin has clearly started to adjust to the WNBA. She has seen the best defenses night in and night out and figured out ways to improve her game. Perhaps where Kaylin truly showed how dangerous she can be was in the open court. Simply put, if her teammates run with her, they are almost guaranteed an easy layup thanks to her amazing court vision. 
Not only did she set a new record in the WNBA, but she achieved something that only two other basketball players in history have achieved. Only three rookies in the NBA and WNBA history have ever recorded 29 points, 5 rebounds, and 10 assists on 70% shooting multiple times. One of them is, of course, Caitlin Clark, who has done it twice. The other is Steph Curry, who did it four times. And the last person on the list is none other than Michael Jordan, who did it twice as well. Anytime you pass up MJ on a list, well, that is a good thing. And speaking of records, Caitlin made WNBA history with her rebounding in Sunday's game against Atlanta. With five rebounds, Clark broke a league record for the most rebounds by a rookie guard in a season. She has 204 for the season with five games remaining. She entered play on Sunday, second among WNBA guards in rebounds per game this season. She trails only Connecticut's son, Dewana Bonner, who entered Sunday averaging 6.4 rebounds. Caitlin's shooting and playmaking often receive most of the attention, but her ability on the glass has put her atop a historic WNBA list. She also did the impossible and turned around the Indiana franchise. Indiana already has as many wins this season as it did a year ago and is tied for the fourth most victories in the league since the start of July. She has also etched her name in the league's historical record. Against the Seattle Storm, she set the record for most assists by a first-year player, passing WNBA legend Tisha Penichero with 12 games to spare. She also has the most assists in a single game, dishing 19 dimes. Along with the record for the most consecutive point assist double doubles in a rookie season, the most double doubles by a rookie guard, the first rookie to record a triple double, the single game leader in three point field goals made by a rookie, and she is the youngest player to record a double double with points and assists in back to back games. What is even crazier is the fact that Kaylin has continued to set new records throughout the season. After averaging 24 points, 8.5 assists, and 5.2 rebounds per game in August, Kaylin was named the Rookie of the Month for the third time, and August Eastern Conference Player of the Month. With this honor, Clark became the first rookie in WNBA history to earn the Player of the Month award. On September 4th, the Fever beat the Los Angeles Sparks in a 93-86 win with Clark posting 24 points, 10 rebounds, and 10 assists, marking her second career triple-double. During this game, she registered her 100th three-pointer made, making her the first to achieve in a rookie season and the fastest player in WNBA history to do so. It took her just 34 games. It was also Clark's third straight game with at least 20 points and 10 assists, equaling Courtney Vandersloot's streak from 2017 as the longest in WNBA history. Her all-around play has helped lead Indiana to its first playoff berth since 2016. Indiana is in sixth place in the WNBA overall standings. The Fever look to maximize their seeding in the final weeks of the regular season. It is safe to say that Kaylin entered the WNBA season with higher expectations than any other rookie. Right away, people expected her to not only dominate, but carry the league on her shoulders. Most rookies come into the league and they'll ride the bench for a while and work on their skill set. A few special cases might start right away, and then there are the ultra special cases who not only start, but make a big impact. Caitlin went beyond this. She was tasked with leading the Indiana Fever back to relevance after a seven-year playoff drought, along with carrying the WNBA to new heights. What other rookies had to take on such responsibility? With the playoffs around the corner, Kaylin will have the opportunity to thrust herself into the upper echelon of players as superstars are made in the playoffs. But seeing how she has been playing, there is no doubt that she will rise to the occasion once more.